Web Browser is a web-based browser that is located in the main toolbar of your My Viewboard Whiteboard software and allows you to access the internet directly from the software. In order to go ahead and open it up for the first time, you're just going to want to click that little swirly hurricane in the main toolbar, tap it once, and as you can see, it's going to welcome you into a bare bones browser that we've got built into the My Viewboard Whiteboard software. As I scroll down, you can see there's a ton of different tiles that I can choose from, which those are editable. I would recommend going and checking out the tiles video for more information on that. However, as you can see at the top, there's a simple Google search. I'm going to go ahead and type in toy theater just because I know that's what I'm looking for right now. And once I've gone and done that, I could go ahead and hit enter and it's going to welcome me into all these different Google search results. From there, I could go ahead and navigate directly through what I need to do. If I want to go back, I can hit the arrows in the bottom left hand corner to go front and back. That little refresh, little arrow going in a circle is the refresh button. If I press the home button, it is automatically going to bring me back to my home page, which is where that Google search is and all those tiles. There's also a keyboard directly next to that, which pops up the keyboard on your screen. Also on the right hand side, you are going to see there's a few other tools that you can mess around with. One of the tools that I like to use is that pen annotation tool. If you want to go ahead and go to a web page, once you've got that activated, you could go ahead and do any type of annotations directly over the browser. The laser pen is great if you want to do some quick highlighting over a, a body of text. The eraser is also there if you want to erase any of the annotations that you want to make on the page. There is also a camera lens there, which allows you to take a screenshot of the web page, which is really nice and really helpful to use if you just want to get a quick snippet of something. You also do have a way to make new tabs, which is simply by tapping the plus sign in the lower left hand side which will then allow you to bring you into a new home page in which you can browse through whatever you want to after that. And in the bottom right hand corner, you do also have the minimize button, the full screen button, and the exit button, which closes the browser.